Hey guys, Super Gadget Guy here. Um, uh, my apologies for not being online for the past month because of Christmas break and New Year. I hope all of you had a great Christmas and a great start on this new year, 2012. All right, um, today I'll be unboxing not one or two, but three headphones that was sent to me by Export. Um, here they are, three different models. Um, it's really hard to tell which is which from the front um, of the headphone, but from the back, you can see this is the model 3010-2, and then this is the 5010-8, and 7010-0. So the 7000, the 5000, and 3000 series. And these can be bought directly from their website, export, X-E-P-O-R-T dot com. And um, these are fairly price-wise, at least pricing-wise, fairly low-end. The 3000 series, um, right now, they sell them for $9.95, even though they have a ridiculous listing price of $49.95. But you can get these for $10. And the 5, the 5010 series is $15. And... The 7010 is $20, $19.95. And I believe these are the retail package, but if you buy them online, they have deals where they include a carry case that's very similar to that of the Shure series, at least from what the website looks like. So let me show you what they are. Very simple packaging. Um, exactly identical, except for the model number printed on the back. So they're saying that hundreds of dollars on your music player and thousands of dollars on your albums, you're pretty much throwing them all away with a pair of poorly made headphones. So they are claimed to be a high quality earphones, even though price wise, it's pretty cheap. Let's see if I can open one of them. So this is the 3000 series. Quick start guide and limited one year warranty. Okay, so um, it does come with a one year warranty and um, spec wise is 20 hertz to 20 kilohertz. Input 5 milliwatt, maximum output 20 milliwatt. Okay, so let's look at the headphone. Um, stuck pretty tight. So they have this soft, so these are like um, in-ear monitors where they have the soft sleeve where you insert into your ear. And then there's the um, sort of etched in left versus right. And with a sort of pink, reddish ascent that has their brand on it, export. And they come with um, two more sizes. This seems like the medium, you can easily tell. They have the small pair and also the large pair for custom fit. And the cable is sort of braille, reinforced like fabric reinforced. If you have one of those um, gaming mice, they're very similar in a sense that it's pretty strong. Um, let's have a slider. Do not see a microphone or control adjustment um, in the middle portion. So the straight plug, kind of like that. Works really well with the uh, iPad 1 that I have because the, the Apple case that my short headphone does not really plug in because it got blocked by the case. So this is the Apple style uh, mini audio plug. So let's look at the other two to see if there's any difference. Let's look at the one step up. So this for $5 more is $14.95. has some extra sort of screw-like type device. Similar cable, um, different color. This is more grayish. And the air piece is larger. Um, also does not seem to have a left or right indicator on the back, but there is on the side where it says an L and an R right here. 
same sort of sleeve setup and same one year warranty um, same sort of output spec no different um, style wise I kind of prefer the 5010 it's a little bit larger and it has a really cool look and it comes with the different color screw that you can pretty much change to your own style liking that's pretty cool um, didn't come with any paperwork to explain and then they had added benefit to replace some of this so the top of the line is the 7010 different color and oh the plug is different so these are the straight plugs for both the 3000, the 3010 and the 5010 but for the 7010 it's more angled right here it has a white braided cable so this is the top of the line it's twenty dollars um, but this is not as big as the 5000 and it's sort of the smallest of the three and this is the one that looks like Apple product the most again let's see if this one shows the same spec for the headphone same exact spec um, for all three models um, they look completely different um, style wise I'm kind of initially through the box I like the 5010 um, but after looking at it this has a sort of not a sort of cheap plastic feel of the 3000 um, this is also plastic with a little bit metal maybe but this is like a ceramic sort of thing with polished bright yeah it's a ceramic um, coating on it which is pretty cool well the most important thing of course is not you know packaging or I, to me style is kind of important but most important is the sound quality I will give each one of these its fair share of test I'll try them all and listen to you know what I usually listen to and we'll do a review video on it and in the end I will actually do a giveaway so stay tuned to the channel and uh, I will make a give video, giveaway video with instructions on how you can be eligible for free headphones. Um, thanks for watching. Please, if you have any questions, post in the comment below. Or if there's any tests you want me to perform, any non-destructive tests you want me to perform, I will be more than happy to uh, test them out and let you know how they compete with the much, much more expensive, expensive Sure, 535s. Thanks for watching.